Hey guys, Philly Moose here, and today we're playing some Ground Garchomp. Now, it's kind of known that Ground Garchomp is the inferior build, but people still ask me about it all the time. And back then when the game released, Ground Garchomp was actually my favorite build until they just overbuffed Dragon to where Dragon is better. I still believe Dragon is better, but that does not mean we cannot have fun with Ground Garchomp, right? Ground Garchomp is a little bit tankier. Here's a look at the build I'm running on Ground Garchomp. It is slightly different. Uh, instead of running the uh, scope lens from uh, Dragon Build, we're actually running weakness policy so that our, our Earthquakes and Digs do a little bit more damage. And our Unite move actually does a bit more damage too because of weakness policy. Uh, so weakness policy, Rapid Fire Scarf, and Focus Band for the items. And then Emblem, same thing uh, as uh, the Dragon Garchomp build. Uh, but maybe we're running White 6 instead of Brown 6. I think health is very valuable and even more so valuable on Ground Garchomp. So maybe consider running White 6. White 6, Brown 6, they're relatively about the same. Uh, but this build definitely makes me really, really tanky. Starting in the game with like an extra 800 HP, it feels like. But let's look at the items and build. How would you guys think about Ground Garchomp? It's, again, it's still not the best, but you can still win with it. And let me show you some winning with it, all right, baby? Drop some like. I do owe Kuhar mod, right? Let me give Kuh mods. Give me a sec, I'll, I'll, I'll mod you right now. This is the right account, right, Kuh? Here we go, add moderator. If I want to donate $500 to stream type, would you allow it? If you gave me $500, I'll let you do whatever. I don't care. I'll lose a game for $500. Sure, donate me $500 and stream site. I'm so down. Yeah, Zard is really bad, dude. Bring back his true damage. Why do they do my boy Zard like that? All right, I also have Rapid Fire Scarf back on because I really do miss the attack speed that game. I felt like felt really weird about the attack speed. Absolutely no hesitation, bro. At the end of the day, this is... Hey, at the end of the day, this is my job, all right? I don't mind, bro. I will lose a game for 500 bucks. Anytime we're in five stacks or I'm against your team, you don't need 500 bucks, I'll throw the game for you. All right, let's go. And, I, uh, and, uh, and I'll pretend like I, I, my finger slipped. All right, I randomly united at 230. <laughs> all right, we're here. Ubitar's here, interesting. Knock him up for our team. There we go. Dig is not too useful, but you know what? When you can actually get a CC off near your team, it's not bad. All right, if you can knock someone up for that one second and your team is hitting them all during that one second, it's pretty dang good. Go up here and get this. I miss playing Dig, man. I, I really liked Ground Garchomp back in the day. Those of you guys who watched me back then know Ground Garchomp was my favorite. But then it's just, it's just so bad in the current meta, it feels like. Earthquake should not be able to be canceled. If they make it so that Earthquake can't be canceled, then I think you'll be okay. But the fact that you can get your Earthquake canceled in a fight is terrible. Because Dig is actually decent. Hmm. To give full stream snipe experience at 500 hours, all your mods will get pissed at you as part of the package. That's part of the package. Knock up everything. I get big? No, I couldn't get big. And again, this is another situation where my team does not roam, but it's okay. It's okay, because I, I I almost killed two in a 1v3. Why do my lanes never roam, bro, ever? It makes sense if both lane, both teams don't roam. That makes complete sense, okay? It's like, oh, in solo queue, people are retarded. They don't know how to roam. How does the enemy team always know to roam, and my team does not know how to fucking roam, dude? It's always that. It's always one way. And I still almost won that. Imagine if I had an LD there. If I imagine I had anything there. I had a surf from Slowbro, a Skull from Slowbro. We would have won that shit so incredibly hard. Oh, he would walk up there. And then my bot lane just loses naturally. Like this is this is what I mean by like games are unwinnable. You you don't get pressure from them. They don't rotate, and they naturally lose lane. How do you win as jungle from that position, you know? Like, it, it's really, really hard. Right, let's get this done. I already got that package from Phil. I didn't even snipe him. Yep, I'm sure you didn't. Go. No one ever admits to sniping. I don't think we have ever had anyone ever admit to sniping before. Let's 
go. Which is smart. You should never... Hey, it's innocent until proven guilty. Never uh, thing. Never admit to a crime, guys. All right? Some lawyer. Some lawyer speak here, man. Can we win this? I guess we get top. Oh, we cannot win this. I gotta go. I'm gonna get Zard United here, maybe. I dropped an Earthquake on the point. Greninja comes in with a Unite. Whoa, Guardi Unite. Okay. This is what I need. This is what I need from my team, baby. This is what I need. Okay. Let's go. All right, 40. I'm trying to zone. Nice, good job. Clickbait has admitted to it. Uh-oh. I, I actually, I just prefer if no one roams, you know? If I, I prefer if my team doesn't roam and the enemy team doesn't roam, and I get to 1v1 the enemy jungler. That would be my preference. But if, the, if, if that's not reality, you know, maybe my team can match the enemy's roams, you know, maybe, you know, so I don't die for free middle. Because I outplayed the shit out of their jungle. I full killed him in a, in a 2v1. If it was a 2v2, I would just kill him and get away and not even die. Okay, Charizard's gonna probably unite here. I can I can uh, unite Charizard unite so he can't grab me. That will get a Charizard killed for sure. Yeah, let's see what he does. Yeah, if I go in and I immediately combo Charizard, he's not gonna be able to unite me. I think we just ripped this. They're not in position. They're not in position. Let's just rip this. Oh, it looks like they're coming. I'm gonna unite here. See, you see that right there? I unite him and then he can't he can't uh, thing he can't unite. Oh, he got teleported back though. Oh, he tell he got teleported. No, I actually united Charizard unite there, but he fucking teleported, man. Ren comes in, okay. Uh, I can't really fight that guy. I'm gonna just hit this. He teleported back, came back with unite. When I when I do that unite play on on Charizard there, it gives him a uh, ninety percent unite charge back. So he came back and just united again normally. I'm a pressing it. Knock him up in the earthquake. I think I might go down here though. Oh no, my band popped. Okay, my team's catching up. Nice, good job, guys. Okay, there we go. All right, you know what? My team doesn't roam, but at least they seem pretty, pretty on top of objectives, you know, and using unites because we actually had some unites come out there. All right, let's go middle. I believe that Charizard players who use their ult the, the same blink as Serena players. Yeah, if he's, if they're ever in any remote pressure or if it's a good time for them to unite, they will always do it. This is how Charizard and Serena players play, you know? Even if it's at like 250, Serena players, I feel like, always unite. All right, I can get 14 this game. Yeah, the combo is so slow with Earthquake, man. If you hit it on a lot of people, I guess it's okay, though. We get 14 here. Thank you. Right, I should natural 14. VIP is like having full body armor on in stream. True. If you're a VIP member, you can get away with a lot more stuff. All right. That's a tip about life too. Okay. The more you pay, the more you can get away with for any aspect. All right. I like doing car analogy. Let's do a car analogy. If you get a really shitty car with no safety features, you cannot get away with doing a bunch of dumb stuff in your car because you crash, you're gonna fucking die. All right? But if you spend a lot of money on a car and it's like, it gives you a lot of protection, it has a lot of safety features, you can do you can, you know, do a bunch of stupid stuff on the road, crash, and still not die. True story. All right, I'm gonna wait and then I'll take this berry. No, nope, nope, Slowbro wants to take. Slowbro is actually 14. How does Slowbro get 14 in this game? I guess he was farming all game, maybe? Yeah, they're back capping, I'll engage. I will engage if y'all want to back cap, bro. Yo, I hit a f like a five man engage. Where's my team, bro? I'm on the Sylveon hard. Okay, I guess we go back. I knock him up, kill him. Nice. Okay, I think we hit now, bro. I think we tap this, bro. 
I'm gonna start hitting this to heal up. Get my stacks up. Let's go, let's go, let's go, guys. Oh man, this could be rough. Nice, good finish. Finish, 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 finish. Nice, there we go. We had two of them down. It was just correct to keep tapping it. Also, uh, Garchomp heals off of the objective, which is nice. Uh, so that I can stay in the fight longer. Charizard does not do true damage anymore. I'm about to 1v2 this. I'm ground Garchomp, man. You think I'll lose to you, clowns? This is actually the one matchup it feels like I'm actually kind of strong in. No, I might still lose. Ooh. Okay, I'm out. Heal off this. What's up, Charizard? What's up? Oh, not so tough now, huh, Charizard? Yeah, you better pop that X speed. LD, 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 LD. Get him, get him, get him, LD. Not so tough now without your Tyranitar brother, huh? Not so tough now. Wait, why can't I score? Pretty good game. Let's go. Nice. Not bad, not bad. We are broken sometimes. Let's kill some NDDs before we go. There you go. Not bad. LD had your back this whole game? LD had my back this whole game? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that, but we won, and that's all that matters. This Now, this was a more fair game. Even though, like... Um, it was just more fair game, it feels like. If you didn't feel like my trio or duo got Omega gapped, because if your trio get gapped, you will never ever win a game, boys. All right, not bad, not bad. Ninja did decent damage, I did decent damage too. Is it bad to lose a match because you got killed by jungle Pokemon? Yes, you should never ever be killed by wild Pokemon. Unless maybe you're running away with one HP or something, you know, and then it like, it randomly hits you. You should never just naturally die. I don't think there's many characters that could even die. Like, if there are characters where if you keep auto attacking on, they will never die to wild Pokemon. What up, Coleman? Welcome in. Aiden, Amana Lady, Rush PK, Divine Bread. If you die due to wild Pokemon, it should be an auto ban and life sentence. It might be, it might be. Aiden, party. Let's get it done. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab Dig. Can we help out bottom here? Duraldon's a good a good uh, Pokemon to pair with Garchomp here because I can knock him up and he can A press him down. Mm. Right, let's chill right here. I'm gonna chill up here actually since they seen me bottom. Oh, slow bro. I block for you, Yukon. Okay. Block for him so he wouldn't die there. Dang, that's rough. I knocked him up? Oh, I left him on 1 HP. I eject Dig there to try and knock him up. But he barely got away. Okay, back into the jungle I go. Get this. Being able to knock up uh, the wild Pokemon before... Before they're able to hit, you know, brings back memories though. Let's go ahead and grab middle here. I'm gonna try and delay my stacks. No, I didn't delay it fast. I didn't delay it enough. As always, enemy team rotates. Three games in a row, the enemy team rotates and my team doesn't. Literally three games in a row. Oh, wait, my slow bro rotated. He was a little bit late, but he came. Okay. You saw it here, guys, live. Three games in a row, okay? Mm. This, this game, I guess, I don't know if you want to count this game as they didn't come, but uh, he was really late to it. But yeah. Yo, we got Splat being a VIP member. Let's go, Splat. Big Splat coming in. Drop some welcomes for Splat. Let's go. We like to see that. Mm. Thank you, Splat. Guys, drop some welcomes for Splat here. I'm about to go ahead and get my levels up. That's why it's called Slow Bro. He is a bit slow, huh? Slow Bro should be there early. If you play Slow Bro, by the way, you should always go middle because your abilities are very, very good against it. All right, let's go bottom. I'm going to get my nine real quick and then I'll go. 
There's the full combo right there. Uh, auto earthquake, uh, auto dig. I'll be down there. Give me a sec. I just need my nine. A little bit late to my nine. I didn't get much of the bees. I don't think I got any of the bees. Middle. I'm here now. I always like engaging with dig ejecto if I can. Excuse me. Bruh. I'm looking. I'm looking. Right here. Huge. Huge dig combo here. I'm cutting through him. I'm cutting through them, baby. That was a really laggy fight because I'm on the switch, but I still cut through all of them. Can we go in? Can we go in, score some more for our Duraludon, maybe? I'm trying. I'll stand on for you. Nice. Let's go. Cool. Got our Duraludon to score, too. He got nine. Go ahead and steal some jungle. Solid play. I want to say, I always like saving my eject for dig, but sometimes you got to use it just to avoid damage. Like, if I got hit by that Mew combo, I would have lost so much health. There we go. Fight on your Earthquake. Oh, man, I'm fighting everyone here, huh? Okay, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't fight everyone. Also, against Mew, you want to catch their Enhance Auto before it hits you. It does a little bit less damage, because it does more damage the farther it travels. So when you walk into it, it doesn't get to travel as far. Hmm. Thanks for the support, you learned a lot. What up, Life Staker? Here we are, let's do some more. Hmm. All right, they're just ODing top. Grab that. Okay. We are on track. We are on track. Let's go. <coughs> ah. mm. We are dig chomp gaming today. I really like playing dig. Ah, I tried. Try my best to steal it. This bush is probably a little bit obvious, but if you go in the very corner of the bush, if you go here, like, this position I'm in is not very obvious. Where Slowbro was there is a bit obvious sometimes. Oh. No, I actually missed Guardi. I'm gonna just unite her down. You can't run from me. There you go. I unite her down. If you ever unite down Guardi on Garchomp, it cannot defend itself. Because all the way... Oh, the only ways Guardi can defend itself is with the ult, which is CC, or a Moonblast, which is CC. But you're unstoppable to CC, so... They can't really defend themselves here. I dodged the Trevenant Unite. I am gonna go down here, maybe. No, I'm not. No, I'm not, baby! Woo! Making sure to use those digs. Making If you use those digs, it knocks up the enemies, right? Gives you some more time to heal and gives you that damage reduction. We do not go down. Let's go. Can I get 15 this game? No, I will have to settle for 14. There's not enough farm on the map for 15. Yeah, I've created the solo to him. Keep fighting, boys. I've never died a day in my life. Remember on Garchomp, guys, all right? If you're one HP, don't run. Fight to the bitter end. Sometimes you might you might live to you might live to see another day. Okay, can I score 50? Dude, they have four top. I might actually be able to score 50 here. Unironically, I might be able to score 50 here. Yo, this is an insane overcap. No, Abzul. If Abzul scored that, that would have been a 49 overcap, which would have been perfect. Okay, let's leave. I just want my 14. There's no reason for me to fuck around in the jungle, because if I die, I give them so many levels for no reason. I'm just going to maintain my level advantage. I forgot why Dragon's better than ground. It's better than ground because it doesn't suck. Doesn't mean you can't win on ground, you know? Like, But it's it's... Obviously way worse. Get both my buffs here. Okay. Hmm. Trevenant's trying to steal my buff. We can get a jailing on Trevenant here, maybe. Nice. It's like Earthquake can get cancelled and and Ground Garchomp is good against melees. Like against Trevenant and Tyranitar there, it was pretty good. But if they if there's ever any range characters or kiting, it's really, really bad. And I don't need to be stronger versus melee characters. I'm already very strong versus melee characters. I need help versus these range characters. You know? 
What the heck? I'm gonna just disengage this, I think. I don't want to fight this, bro. Oh, man, I don't want to fight this. I did not want to fight that, bro. I got chunked too. What the hell? Okay, my boy with the 10 year late unite. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, I don't think you do. Uh, maybe, 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 maybe. Maybe he can do it fast enough. I actually don't know. I actually don't know the, 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 the post nerf throughout on numbers. Maybe. Oh my God. By the way, you fucking clown. Never stand in the circle when you're securing. This dude is like in melee range, kissing fucking Rayquaza's nuts. That's how you get knocked up. Use your range and hit them from afar. We almost lost that, bro. We legitimately almost lost that, man. Yo, more. thank you for the gift membership, my man. Life Stealer coming in, becoming a member. What up, Life Stealer? Drop some welcomes. Slow bro, save the day. Bro, that was so risky right there, man. There's no reason to stay in the circle, man. Especially on a range character, bro, okay? Especially on a range character. Sometimes on a melee character, I'll walk out, right? But on a range character, you cannot be in that circle, man. You're trying to, like, get your shit stolen, dude. The round on had the right idea. The execution needed some work, though. But you know what? He had the right idea. I actually... My initial thought was I doubted the rip. But it was actually a really good idea to rip. That shows that I'm a little bit, you know, um, thing. I'm a little bit washed when it comes to the round on decision making. Since I haven't played it in a while. I don't think that's runnable yet, though. How you doing, Nikki? Hey, you Overlord. Welcome in, welcome in. Zekrom. Let's go. My boy, Mad Scientist over here. Overlord. When I see the real Overlord run it, then I will believe in the zoom reel. Ah. One white, five black. Hold up. That's yo. That's the Brazzers build, bro. <laughs> I should make a video called the Brazzers build. <laughs> One white emblem, five black emblems. Hmm. All right, let's go. Let's get it done. I don't know what my boy's cooking, but we might need to get him out of the kitchen. Hmm. Why no yellow in the build? Oh my God, there's too many colors. I'm here bottom. Knock up one, but it pushes me away. Let's heal up, get ready for the fight. I think we might lose this actually, bro. We have Lucario. We gotta be ready for combat. Bro, I just got full CC'd. Maybe we can kill though. Nice, there's one. Nice. Okay, this actually works out nice. I lagged a bit when I ejected, but I want to eject just to ensure that I got the kill on him. So I shouldn't have picked all up all those up. That's my fault. Grab this. Nice. Guys, make your predictions now. Will our team rotate mid? Yes or no? Make the predictions in chat. Yes, they will rotate, or no, they will not rotate. Uh, uh oh, what is this? He got it, but I got his life though. You know what? Not the worst. No, no, yes, no. Usually it's a no. It is usually a no, but I'm excited to see what goes on, though. I'm going to keep my stacks up here. There we go. I got my Earthquake. No, it's it's really hard to get in the middle on time with the stacks. It's actually, like, impossible, it feels like. So far, it looks like no, but it's also no from the enemy team. No, it is yes from the enemy team. Okay, those of you guys who guessed no, you are correct. Those of you guys who guessed no, you are correct. Imagine if I had a teammate there. All right, when I drop their Greninja to one, imagine. Imagine, folks. Yep. Congratulations. It was a no. They do not come help me. If it was a 1v1, I would have beaten Greninja. Because I almost beat him when he 2v1 me. But you know what? Do we win a kiss now? Now I might have to kiss all the people that said no. All right, let's go. All right, let's just rip this down. I'm not nine, unfortunately. He's also not nine, though. Oh, my God. Uh, we're going to get our shit stolen if we rip it, though. Fuck it, whatever. I'm going to rip it, build some stacks. I have knock-up if Gren comes in. I knocked him up. Nice. Finish this. 
Honestly, not bad. Gren went back to get us nine, and we instantly punished him for it. Because we just took the we just took the objective on eight. Sometimes I like going back and getting nine personally. Uh, but sometimes you can get punished for it, as you can see here. The kiss and fill will make me die of no Gregets. Become a member. Let's go. Alright, let's go top. I was peeling for for thing there. Dude, Earthquake should never be cancelled, man. It's getting low, man. Gimme that shit! No! No! I thought I had it. Here's two. I thought I had it, man! I'm fighting, man. I'm legit fighting 1v5. Oh, I thought I had it, bro. I thought I had it. Shit. I was really close. Yo, welcome in. How you doing, Baki? What's up, man? I finally got around to watching the Mammal video. Very insightful. Did you ever find out if the last game was a <laughs> lobby? I, I did not find out. I should ask Fraggles about that one, Baki, actually. <laughs> hmm. That's funny how that works, though. All right, I was 1v5 and I killed two. You know what? Maybe I should have killed three, right? Why didn't I kill three? Give Earthquake Suns. Just make it so the Earthquake sh cannot be canceled. I'll be happy with that. Until until future developments come. But it, it's already such a bad move. And then on top of it, you can get it canceled. It's terrible. Nah. The only way we got that was if I outwhipped it. Hmm. Or maybe make it so that if you fight in the Earthquake. If they're going to make it so it's going to get canceled, they can even make it a lot better. Make it so that if you fight in the Earthquake, like, um, you can thing. I don't know. You do more damage or something. You get two stacks per auto or something. I don't know. I got it canceled again, bro. This move is so bad, man. It's truly so bad because if you get it canceled, you lose three stacks. Like the, the benefit of Earthquake is supposed to be you, you can stack earlier, right? You get your five stacks really, really early. But you can't even do that because it just gets canceled by everything. Hmm. I'm broke. What do you mean? I spent $60 on Kirby in the Forgotten Land. If you can spend $60 on Kirby, you can spend five or $10 on a membership, my man. All right, let's go. Ooh! Right, I'm gonna just power through. Nah, I can't. I could have ejected that maybe. No, man. I could have ejected that. It's, it's really annoying to play in the Greninja smoke screen, man. It's really, really annoying. I had three bottom though. It was a good timer for me to unite. What up, Coop? Thank you for the two months, my man. Become a member today. Hmm. We need to bring the $5 clip again. We might need to get the $5 clip back in here, bro. Hmm. We might need to get the $5 clip in here. Alright, let's go top. I get the mime. This time I should did not get cancelled. But I can't see! I need to hit this to... thing. Oh man, it's 50-50. Okay, it healed, it healed. Oh my god. Okay, no A9 Unite. I was waiting to secure it, man, but A9, A9 just... Nice, okay, we got it. Nice, not the worst. It looks like we're gonna go in a little bit behind this game, bro. I'm so low level this game. I have seven kills, though, but I'm still low level. Let's go, Coop. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, white 6, 460 seems pretty solid, yeah. Let me get my level... Yep, let me go ahead and get my level 13. Looks like 13 is our cap this game. Uh, I usually prefer going 14 if possible. Can I go 14? I might be able to go 14, actually, if I get all the farm on the map. I might be able to go 14. Let's try and go 14. I really like being 14 on, on Garchomp. You just get so much more stats. Let's try and farm fast. Maybe we can just about get it. We might just be about be able to get it. How I can tell sometimes if we have enough farm is I look at the map and I'm like, okay, if I farm everything reasonable to me, can I get 14? And it looks like there was actually enough farm. As, as you see, I have a little bit extra and I can still get this blue here too. So it didn't count if we got the Reggie in the bottom or not. Let's go. I'm gonna wait for Sylveon before I engage. We're struggling, so we need to fight. They're back capping. Yo, we should we should look for a play here. 
If they're back having, we gotta look for a play. I'm low key ripping it. I'm on Dragonite. The Dragonite's down. Mime's down. Got it. Got him. I didn't even miss that final one. You saw that? That final. Oh, let's go, baby. You back cap top. I'm gonna pressure the ray. You can't do that for free. You cannot do that shit for free, bro. Yeah, no one ever comes middle, Zekrom. Yep. Like four games of Garchomp in a row. Come adding in the ones I played yesterday, no one ever comes middle. I don't know why. On my team, they never come middle. On the enemy team, they're like, yo, go mid, go mid, bees, eight minutes, right now, right now. <laughs> mm, fast as FF, yep. All right, MVP, not bad. Pretty solid game overall. Other than all the times I got my shit canceled. <laughs> mm.